Hello good people of YouTube and this video is a full fix for Strict NAT. If you're suffering from Strict NAT on the Xbox 360, this is how you fix it. First I'll show you the quick fix, which is basically if you normally open and it suddenly goes strict for no reason, this is how you fix it. If this doesn't do it, then try resetting your router. So basically just follow what I just did on the screen, go into your network settings and test your connection. When that's finished, then it should open up if you have normally an open and AT. If you're suffering from strict AT all the time, it's a lot harder to deal with, but I found a great website recently where basically it gives you a step-for-step -step guide for your individual router on how to fix your strict NAT, which is brilliant because when I had to do it myself, I had to find out exactly what ports and learn how to do it myself, which was a pain. Super speed. Yeah, my disk went unreadable, so I had to speed that up because it took forever. And as you see, when I log back in, gone to multiplayer, my terrible Xbox takes ages to load anything, but um, yeah, you'll see that I have open AT. So next thing I'll show you is this website, which gives you a step-by-step -step guide on how to open up your NAT with almost any router you can think of. I'll uh, show you a quick picture of the website after this. See, NAT is now open, which is good news, of course. So I hope that bit helped if that's not the case. Right, this is the website. I'll put a link down. It's port forward, and this is what it looks like when you start it up. If you get like a screen where it says you you can buy something in the top right it says skip advert just do that if you ever see that so you scroll down from the link and you get this you get a list of tons of routers so you need to look on the back of your router to find out what model it is by what make and anything you can about it then you normally get an advert so you want to click top in the top right it says skip this advert so you do that and then you get this page which is basically a list of all different games and things that you would want to open with that router. So you're going to go down the right and you're going to look for Xbox 360, Call of Duty, Black Ops. You click on that and it should give you a nice little page guide of how to fix your NAT, how to open up your ports. And I hope that helped. If you've been struggling then this should fix it. But make sure once you're done you reset your router, reset your Xbox, and uh, good luck with it. Thanks for watching. If this helped, please support us in subscribing. It would be great. And goodbye.